welcome to this week's MVP segment on High School Cube News. I'm Beth Long at Oak Park River Forest High School, where we are featuring a dual threat and very dynamic quarterback, Lloyd Yates, who's headed to Northwestern. Lloyd, the Huskies are off to a pretty fast start. What's been the keys for you guys early on this season? Uh, we really just, you know, want to uh, play at a fast tempo and execute really well. And if we, if we do that, we believe that we have a chance in every game we play. Oak Park River Forest is a program that had a pretty good season last year. What are you guys doing to top that this year? We're just better execution. Uh, you know, we, we did lose a lot of players last year, some key guys, you know, in the defense and offense especially. So, you know, um, definitely a lot of juniors are stepping up and filling that role. And then, you know, we just want to execute and play it week by week. And for you, what are some ways that you've improved from last season to this season? Uh, I think definitely I, I've put on a lot of weight. You know, I uh, gained about 10 pounds over the off season. I think that was huge. Uh, just became, you know, got smarter at the game and, you know, tried to, you know, perfect my performance. You have an interesting story <laughs> of Huskies. You and Adam Limke Bell are both headed to Northwestern. Doesn't happen very often to see two yeah. people from the same team going to the same big time college football program. What was that decision like when, <laughs> when Adam decided first right. and you decided? When right. you decided you were going to join him, what was that like telling him? That, that was huge. Uh, honestly, you know, we've always thought about going to college together and um, Northwestern has always been, you know, a huge option. But uh, when it really worked for both of us and we both got offered, uh, you know, that's a school we both wanted to go to. And, you know, hey, it worked out and we're excited. And not only are you guys going to the same school, I mean, he could be blocking for you one could day, be. you know, yeah. from the quarterback <laughs> position. So, yeah. like, what is that bond you guys have created like, and what's it going to be like to be able to carry it to the next level? It's going to be awesome. I can't wait. Uh, it's definitely a bond that we've grown over the past couple of years, and hopefully we get to continue throughout college. And you're absolutely a dual threat quarterback. Are you stronger passing game or running game? <laughs> uh, I, I don't think, you know, I could definitely say either or. I just, you know, try to make a play. When you're going through your mind, if, you, if you've got the option, like, do you default to run, pass, just depends on the coverage? What is your, what's going through your mind when you, like, take that snap? Uh, it's definitely, you know, natural instinct. Um, first, I go through my reads. If it's a pass, you know, go, go through my reads, who I read on that pass. If things fall apart, I just uh, let instinct take over and, you know, try to make a play out of nothing. How has your leadership style, like, developed and changed, and what kind of leader do you aim to be when you leave here? Uh, I try to lead by example, but that, you know, that's, a, that's, that's the weird thing, you know, I'm so used to, you know, others leading, you know, before me, telling me what to do and, you know, picking me up and things like that, but now it's my time and it's our time, so it's definitely, you know, a lot different, but uh, I just try to lead by example, be a positive guy and motivate everybody. And just how good can this team be? Uh, we could be great. I, I really believe so. Uh, I think we could be better than last year and we could be playing Thanksgiving weekend, hopefully. Lloyd, you mentioned you have some talented receivers on this team. Give, give me a rundown of exactly who you think will be some standouts we may not know about at this point. Uh, Kewan Ratcliffe, Cole Fields, uh, Brashawn Wilkerson, and uh, Kamal Bay. I think those are, you know, freak athletes on the perimeter and inside slots, and they can make plays. And what are some goals for you guys as an offensive unit this season? Uh, score as much as we can. You know, we, we really want to, you know, put our defense in better situations by scoring the ball, moving the ball, um, at least a touchdown a quarter. In only a few games under your belt this senior season at this point, just looking forward, what are some ways you think you guys will really be focusing on improving? Uh, going faster. We really want to be fast. That's one of our main focus is to be fast and execute. So the faster we can go and the more we can execute, the better we'll be. Thanks, Lloyd, and congratulations once again. Lloyd Yates from Oak Park River Forest is this week's MVP on High School Cube News. Make sure you stay tuned for next week.